Hey, my beloved people, Nikians, how are we doing? You're welcome back on my channel on Nikki's Thoughts. If it's your first time here, I want to welcome you into the to this beautiful house on, on lifestyle, on faith. I'm a, I'm a child of God, I'm a minister of God, I'm a family mother, and so. Um, just like the name implies, I feel more many things that comes in my thoughts um, that I think I want to share with you. So this afternoon, if you have not subscribed to my channel, I will implore you to please subscribe to this channel and help this family to grow. Help us to grow. And again, um, yes, even though I'm in my 50s, but I have a very young heart. Um, yes. So, um, in as much that we're not being rude to each other, um, please leave your comments and let me learn from you and you learn from me too. Um, quickly, I'll just go back straight to what uh, the topic of today. Um, yes, what comes my thoughts? I was having this chat with an 18 year old girl or a, a multi-year-old woman, you know, and um, and then the, the, uh, this talk became really hot. I uh, was talking about um, hygiene in general. So, and in the, in, during the talk, I just mentioned that, you know, as a female, it's very essential that you, you, your hygiene is very important to you. And I just said, be like, oh, you shouldn't be talking like, like that. Oh, okay, let's say, a mom, I didn't expect you to say things like that. Okay, let me just do it like that. Oh, um, every person, every person, either everybody, anyway. Either you are a female or male, must look after their health, must look after their hygiene, and they must do this. And then we went on, we went on. Why is it African parents believe that men should do, women should do this, women should do this, and men should do this, and girls should be doing this, girls should be doing that. And then the argument just became so, you know, just gone out of. The, where I was taking it to from, you know, it's as if this, this woman or you know, this lady has been waiting for me to actually say something and then she can beat me up in that manner. And I had to explain to, to her that actually you, you took me, you took me wrong and then, and that's not what I meant. What I meant is as a woman, um, as a female, we have to take hygiene very important and and that we women or female we menstruate and then um, we have to clean after ourselves and again god forbid when you start having baby or i was talking to the, the lady I said, you have to look after your son, you have to look after the baby. And then, yes, another argument came in. Oh, I'm not the only one that has a baby. I'm not the only one that has a baby. Why should it be me cleaning after myself? Not still. I said, okay. Would the, the husband or the partner help you to keep your outfit, keep that place clean, keep everything, keep your work? Okay, he can look after the child. But what if the man is not there at all? What if the man is not there? So I, it's, I said it's not about a, a, um, um, a boy. A boy is not his, um, I'm not talking about boys here. I'm not talking about male, let me put it like that. I'm just talking about everybody needs to be clean, like you said, but I'm talking about a woman, a female, have to take extra care with their body and this one this has nothing to do with segregating or 
favoritism or because a man has to be treated in a certain way or women have to be treated in a certain way. I just believe that as a woman or as a female, the nature has made it like that, that we have responsibilities. Men doesn't carry babies in their tongue. Men doesn't do some certain things. Even though I know some men will want to do that, but that's just the nature. That's just the nature. And then if you don't learn to clean after yourself now, you might not have to clean it when you grow up anyway or when you settle down because eventually life will teach you to be able to clean. But practice me perfect. And this has something to do with either you are uh, a female or, or, or I'm picking up on you or I'm saying this because you are a female. I wasn't picking up on 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 us, so in case this argument wanted to go out of hand, we're just chatting. But this this um the um, the, um, the chat just became so it and it becomes we have to like I have to keep quiet because a lot of things were like men 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 men. No, this world is not like that anymore. I'm talking of 18 years old. That was the world when you, you were, uh, and I said, oh, my dear, I wasn't even talking about female or female or, or my responsibility here or woman responsibility here. I'm talking about women. Female, as a gender, have to look after herself. The uh, hygiene has to be, you know, intact. We have to learn all those and to clean up ourselves because we have responsibility later in the future when we start having children, and not all the time the female men will be there to look after that child. At least that child will need your attention as a parent for the next one year. So, I don't know. I said I'm going to be the topic here. What do you think? What do you think about that topic? Do you think female, um, let's leave gender um, um, inequality out of the question here. Or as a female, um, as, as nature demands of us, do you think female have to clean after themselves? Do, do, they, do you think we parents should teach our children, our female children, to look really look after themselves? Or we look with the way we, 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 yes, we're, we're teaching them equally, we're teaching our female. So if you're lucky to have both female and male child, that's good. That's good. But in a situation whereby you have girls, you have a female, only female, or anyway, should we put a lot of effort um, or, or to make sure that hygiene is it's really important for our female children? And how do we make them to see that this has something to do with gender equality or inequality? Or am I the one getting it wrong here? Please leave your comments. I don't mind you being correct. You are not telling me the way, but too much. That's the only thing. Um, your constructive um, comments, even though it doesn't have to go with mine, you might have a, another opinion, but when you leave it constructively, start aloud, I really want to learn. Like I said, I've said in my one of my videos that I have, I have, I have one female and I have three girls, and they all are uh, they are all um, adults. The last baby will be 18, so I have so I really need to learn. And I'm learning from youth. I work blogs on you on younger um, couples, single, married, because I want to keep myself up there to be able to be there for them as a mother as well to learn. Like I said, I'm young at heart as well. So please leave your comments. Am I being wrong here? Or how can we how can I address this issue? Until I see, or I, I'll be waiting to see your comments. And until you, you hear from me again, hear me, Nikki. I said it in my um, one of my videos. I'm not sure maybe the video is up. I have lots of videos that I've not, I've not, um, and set out there and that I'll be referring us to um, 
Nikians or my beloved. Which one do we prefer? Nikians coming from Nikki, Nikki Sport, or my beloved people. God bless you all. Have a wonderful week ahead. And until you hear my voice again, here on, here on Nikki Sport. Bye for now.